Fill her up. You're listening to the Gas Digital Network. In your own by, guys, it's all about being sensitive, having fun, and just really being yourself. It's the bye guys. The bye guys. The bye guys. The bye guys. Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Bye Guys. We are in the new studio. I couldn't be happier about it. Uh, look at this. We're on the beach. Isn't it wonderful? Look at that. Jeffrey's excited. Wow. Yes, I'm so happy to be on the beach. Hopefully there'll be a nice... Oh, can we get a green screen lifeguard running by with big bazungas bouncing and some balls? I'll do, I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Zach, I'm going to pretend I'm drowning. Give me CPR. Uh, this is our first time in the studio together, Zach. It's good to be with you, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, man. It's going to be a fun day. Yeah, let's introduce our guests. Absolutely. Let's do, I'll introduce one, you introduce one. To my left, joining the show again, uh, new good buddy, uh, really fucking funny comic, Tristan Bowling's here. Hey. Tristan. How we doing? Guys? Yes. Good. Thank good. you for doing the show. And to my right, the very funny, the wonderful, new special out. New special yes. out. Yes. What's it called? The Only Funny White Man. Yes. Sorry. Jeffrey. Asmus. Yes. Thank you for having me. Yes. This place rocks. Hell thank yeah. you for coming. This is yeah. cool. Yeah. You do something that I think is so interesting oh, that no. I don't know if uh, I could do uh, is you take all the comments people write on your stuff. Oh, yeah. And you post like very funny people ones. People are very mean to me. But that mind. means you have to go through so many evil things. Yeah. Something about me just incites people's like hatred of mankind. I don't know what it is. I get called some terrible shit online. I yeah, don't know why? But you 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 hone in on certain things, and it's very funny. But you have to. How do you sift through so much of that and not? I like read them someone? all, and I get very sad until I find a really funny one. <laughs> if I go a couple days without a funny one, I'm like, I gotta quit. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I love when they call me a soy boy and that shit. That's, oh, that yeah, stuff yeah, makes yeah. me laugh so much. Yeah, I love that beta shit. Yeah, they're like, he's a little bitch. He's a little faggot. Oh, yeah, yeah, cool. yeah. Okay, cool, man. Yeah, <laughs> guy with a truck as his profile picture. I great, know. Great. And they're cool. like, well, how come you said it should be? Free speech. You should say anything. You fuck it, and then they put like asterisks. Yeah, they, they can't won't say, say what they want. Yeah, they yeah. know the algorithm will yeah, hurt yeah. them. Yeah, yeah. They're like it's free speech except for our corporation overlord, <laughs> yeah, yeah. little baby. I Instagram. still want to go viral. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. They're such losers. Yeah, so. I. Oh God. Well, God bless America. <laughs> God bless America. That's <laughs> yeah. the point of this podcast. Oh, right? and speaking of God blessing, oh. we have to say something. Uh, news today. Very sad. Paul Rubens has yes. passed. B.B. Herman. Yes. The one victim of cancel culture, the original victim. He's masturbating yeah. in a movie theater. Now a victim yeah. of cancer culture. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no. Oh, no, Paul. No. That's the secret word of the day. <laughs> <laughs> Pee Wee's Playhouse did not have universal health care. They did mm. not have chemo. Pee Wee, yeah. what if he found out he got cancer from Jombie? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I never saw the show. What? No, I've never seen it. How? It's it's iconic. It's classic. I never. I Pee Wee's the greatest. I think like it was before my time. Maybe. How, when were you born? 1990. Whoa. Yeah. Disgusting. Is it good? It's the yes. Greatest. Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. his first. Bas- we talked about it. I think last week. Or I've been bringing it up a lot, and I had no idea he was sick. Uh, obviously, and tell people what a. Uh, his special at the Roxy, his first HBO special mm-hmm. that the show is a kid's version of, is fucking hilarious. Really? Okay. Is it? Yeah, it was a live show he did in L.A. with the because he was from the Groundlings. Really? Mm-hmm. So everyone in the live show were Groundlings. I didn't know he did stand up. So it's well, no, it's uh, it's a full stage show oh. of what would become the Pee Wee Herman show. Yeah, him and Phil Hartman. Because him, like... Phil Hartman, um, and then Miss Yvonne is and still is. Uh, Charlie's mom from Always Sunny. No oh. shit. That's Miss Yvonne. Huh. Mm-hmm. They're the fucking chain smoking one. like, I don't get it. No, no, shit. that's Max's mom. Oh, never mind. Charlie's mom's a slut that got gang banged by Santa's. Oh, that makes yeah. more sense. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah I was yeah. just like, she's in Pee Wee's fucking house, yeah. dude. That's crazy. <laughs> she the ashtray? Dude, I would, every time he lost his bicycle, I would cry. <laughs> yeah? It, he, Doesn't that happen dude, every episode? His, that no, no, thing? that was the oh, movie, Pee Wee's Big Adventure. Movie. That okay. was like how. It started. That was a dark film. 
Pee Wee's Big Adventure. It got pretty dark in some parts, but oh. dude, you gotta watch it. It's so good. I should. I would sob and cry when he would lose his bike, and I think that's part of the reason why I love bicycling as an adult. <laughs> yeah. You know. <laughs> Just and, being uh, Pee Wee, you uh -huh. should get the Pee Wee style bike, dude. The red dude, one. I would. I used to wear bow ties and little suits because of Pee Wee. I you loved like Pee Wee. Eight year old kid. I in a bow tie. loved Pee Wee. Dude, you must have gotten your ass kicked. <laughs> yeah. No, dude, I knew karate. <laughs> dude, that's the worst thing to know. I took karate, so no one would kick my ass. Karate in a bow tie. <laughs> that's a sight. That's a sight. That's, that's the name fun. of the episode. Karate, karate in a bow tie. tie. I like that. Jesus yeah. Christ. Yeah, he would. He would lose his bike. I guess. I was like four. I wasn't, you know, oh, okay. an eight-year-old sobbing. That's what I thought you were. No. So I don't, I don't I know think the time frame. Pee, Pee Wee's Playhouse came out what, in 88 or 85? I forget. I'm not sure. I was born in 87 when I watched it. Yeah. Yeah, I remember watching it. I, I just have such a vivid memory in my head of him losing his bike, and I was like laying on the floor watching. I was just like crying, and my parents <laughs> had to fast forward to the end to where he got it back. <laughs> I was like, okay, It took right. so long for you to see the all full right. movie. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah like, cause I just got done. <laughs> Shut this kid the fuck up. We need him to get the bike back. But you're right, dude. That was... He was... Destroyed, destroyed because he for... was masturbating in the place where you were supposed to masturbate. He did nothing wrong. He nothing did, wrong. Did nothing wrong. He, he got a... caught being a grown up with a kid show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Grown up yeah. Thing. People assume that oh, he's like on a kid show. He doesn't have cum in him. Yeah, yeah. he's got cum. Yeah, he he does, he's come. a eunuch. He doesn't he, have a penis. Yeah, yeah. We cut him off. Yeah. Arguably, they may have the most cum out yeah. of everyone. They're, They're just caught... pound up, dude. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You can't fucking release that cum. Yeah. You're around kids all the time. Right. <laughs> yeah. Since yeah. you've never right. seen Pee Wee, I'll give you the gist of every episode. Pee Wee has a playhouse. All the furniture talks. It's like a kid. If a kid had a fantasy, all the toys are alive. Shit like that. Miss Yvonne comes over. She's the prettiest lady in Playland. Is then, he in love with her? Is it like a sexual he's thing? He's very in love with her. Okay. However, then some swarthy guy comes, be it Cowboy Curtis, <laughs> be it uh, the soccer, the, Sp the Mexican soccer player. Uh -huh. Some hot dude comes over. Miss Yvonne has a crush on him. Pee Wee gets mad. By the end of the episode, realizes we're all friends. And then Pee Wee goes away on his bike while presumably some dude pounds out Miss Yvonne in front of all this sentient furniture. So it's like a cuck show. <laughs> yeah. Every episode like is, is some cucked. hot dude comes over and then Pee Wee's like, I'm going to leave you two alone. And then he flies away <laughs> on his bike <laughs> while Miss Yvonne, I, I assume the furniture is all And the just couch watching. is just screaming. Just <laughs> like, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Just, over here. There's just sentient tarps they're putting all over all the furniture. We got to clean up and just be like, oh no, it's Tony the tarp again. <laughs> oh, dude, that basically is what it's I turned every into. Every episode. Yeah. Of me having crushes on girls that be like, you have a great personality. You're so fun. Hotter guy. See See you later, right. child in a bow tie. Yeah. I'm like, oh no. I'll have to ride my bike. The secret word for today is revenge. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and there'd be a secret oh, word. A secret. And every time okay. someone would say the word, everyone would go, ah! Oh, uh, okay. I like this. Yeah. I want to see this. this yeah, it was right. so I'm fun. I'm the secret word of the airport is bomb. <laughs> <laughs> that, that'll get people riled up. That was the secret word of that joke. <laughs> um. <laughs> I'm you. kidding! Wow, wow. He's, he's going in. I love it. Going love in. It. But yeah. Oh, also, what was uh? Do you remember Paul Rubens was in Buffy the Vampire Slayer too? Yes, and Mystery oh. Men. Yes, and Mystery Men. I knew that. And one, yeah. he was incredible in Thirty Rock when he was the uh, oh the prince the the prince who was falling apart. <laughs> yeah, he was like an inbred prince. That really, um, really? Jenna like wanted to sleep with so she could have wealth. <laughs> but uh, his like nose is falling he off. He must have been old he... as hell by then. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It. I mean, it, yeah. There he is. That was. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. He looks fucking nuts. Dude. God, he got such a bad shake. Did he like have so like unfair. a private battle with cancer? I never knew he yeah. was sick. Yeah, apparently he, he, didn't, tell he didn't tell anybody for six years. Mm -hmm. That's the way to do it. Dude. I really That's respect so that. I yep. really respect that. It's like Norm. Yeah. yeah. Don't bum everybody I, out. I, I don't want that. people. You don't need the mm -hmm. attention or anything. Fucking calling and asking how I am. Mm -hmm. Like, that's it, man. That's Chadwick yeah. Bozeman did. Dude. What? Yeah, oh, yeah. Chadwick Bozeman. Yeah. yeah. Now, yeah. would you do it until the end or a week out? Would you be like, hey, everyone? But I would be afraid. like a month out. I would be afraid, though, of being like, hey, everyone, look, I have cancer. I'm going to be dead. By the and then I just live and I'm like, hey guys, oh, my yeah. bad. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah. Like we would all hate that too. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> like that comic who got an HBO yeah. special yep. and had cancer and is mm-hmm. still alive today. Yeah, yeah. He's still partying yep. hard. Yep. Yep. Even though the yeah. kind of cancer they had said so they should never drink again. Yeah. Which makes people question whether or not how bad it was in the first yeah, place. Uh-huh. Been, I, yep. Yeah, it might not have been real. But glad they got their bag. Yeah. yeah. Glad they got their money. It's fucking cool, dude. <laughs> did you see the special? I never watched it, Neither but I assume I. it was terrible. I really want to watch it. I, I bet of it Of just like a special from like a massive drunk liar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just, you know. <laughs> well, it was the guy who wouldn't have gotten a special unless he was dying. Yes. yes. His dying wish was to get a special. Give me an HBO special. Now yeah. he's in Louisiana somewhere right mm-hmm. now. Hey, Ian, could you repeat the sentence you said? Fuck, I don't want to do it. What? I don't want to oh, do okay. it because I don't mean it. It's right. just a funny thing, uh, and I feel bad, uh-huh. but I really want to do it now. Well, now you have to because you, you your attention to it. I don't again? even know what the sentence was. You want to get a special from a huh? massive drunk liar? What was that you said? You what? want to hear a special from a massive drunk liar? It's called The Machine. Oh! <laughs> I'm kidding. I think Bert's the coolest. I really do. It's just a really funny, mean thing to say. <laughs> I do think Bert rules. Oh, I got chills. I thought you were going to say something about me. but it was... No. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, all right, all You'll right. never get a special. <laughs> oh, you're not fat. Tight. You Gloves tight. are off in the new studio. <laughs> <laughs> I feel so. Literally the other night, I put on Razzle Dazzle, the last bird special. And my wife goes, "What is this number five? We're watching this." And oh, I was like, "Yeah, I like it." She's yeah. like, "All right, well, you know, you've made me watch this five times now. Yeah. Maybe something else tonight." See, that's what's great about me is when I do that, my cat can't talk. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he doesn't say that stuff. It's screaming inside. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's screaming. screaming. God forbid yeah. he could, dude. Dude, the saddest fucking thing. <sighs> On my flight back to the city yesterday, I spent the entire flight just scrolling, looking at pictures of me and my cat. Oh, <laughs> on your phone, you're just looking at your photo gallery just the whole time? You have that many? I have How a many folder thousand? for him. Oh, my God. Does, oh wait, my does God. your iPhone make it? Uh, no. The me and I have one. No, no, I iPhone literally it. made me it's think. Just, is it selfies? I is it like selfies of you Oh, and your dude, cat? it's... It's selfies, it's him rolling around, it's him being cute, it's me playing with them, oh, it's wow. people holding the camera to take pictures of us. That's cute. It's I just I miss him so much when I'm on the road. It's pathetic. Do you think about bringing him? I'd love to, but I don't think that'd be if if I had done it when he was a kitten, yeah. but you can't do it when do they're cats like go older. nuts when you they leave. They, they don't travel a lot of them don't travel. travel. Well, okay. If you travel with him as a kitten and train him, but like sure. I think he would just lose his mind. But oh god, that'd be so fun. <laughs> Just stand in a Holiday Inn in yeah. Des Moines with yep. a cat. Yeah. Me in a robe, Big him time. in a little like blanket I've made into a robe. <laughs> <laughs> You're like a bed of a babushka for your little yeah. baby. <laughs> Every time uh, my cat goes in the carrier, he shits. Really? Oh, yeah. If he goes in the carrier, he flips out. He fucking oh. drops one. He meows the whole oh. time. Like we're, like we're sticking him with needles. Mm. He goes, Meh. Do you oh, put the yeah. cat under your seat when you... Fly with him? I don't where, fly with him. But if you did, is that what people do? I, don't I even Well, know. I would that say, would look, he's a good guy. I vouch for him. He can <laughs> sit on my lap. <laughs> <laughs> Who cares about the laws I vouch yeah, for? Yeah, I like, vouch for this God. guy. Come yeah, on. We know each other. I have a folder of photos yeah. to prove it. <laughs> yeah. He's a good dude. Come on. Uh, my girlfriend yeah. flew with her cat, our cat to get here. Whoa, what was that like? Um, Dude, he's he was drugged up. Out of his mind. Like, from Phoenix to here, it's like four and a half hours. What do you drug him with? Oh, just like cat drugs, which are pretty much almost people drugs. Isn't that ketamine? Yeah, pretty much. It was like... Ketamine. Yeah, ketamine. There it is. Ketamine. Wow. Wow. That's what got you the special. (laughs) 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 No, but like, she had to take him out. While they're going through TSA, you have to take him out of the carrier. So he's just like a little... He was like 16 Did he have to go through the machine? Yes, she was was carrying him through the machine. Make sure they don't have a balloon of cocaine up their ass. Dude, he has more than a balloon, bro. (laughs) (laughs) He's a big boy. He's a Oh, Dude, I got so mad. I saw this... Uh, like Russian influencer that tattooed her cat. Fuck that, oh. dude. Right? What Wrong. a fucking What a asshole. bitch. The what cat bitch. was passed out and they tattooed. Oh, you oh couldn't even God. see it. It has. Fur. It's a hairless cat. Oh. oh. What What did they give? What kind of tattoo? It was dumb. It was like uh, an angel with a skull. 
Oh, that's Who's a fucking Russian dumb tattoo. That's, said the that's... guy with his arms covered in dumb <laughs> yeah. tattoos. Yeah. But you're not a cat. You're no. not a cat. Different context. Yeah. Rare. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Would you pay? You know that guy paid to be a dog? Are you going to pay to be a cat? Did you oh, see that? the guy. Oh, the there Japanese it is. Look. Guy. The Japanese oh, guy paid. Oh, that's the cat tattoo? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at him. That's that, wrong. That cat needs to be in a motorcycle. Uh, also, the a... tattoo should be higher. Yeah, like, it's, it's the... bad placement. It it's fucking like it's stupid. Middle. Move the tattoo up below its neck, dude. There's a picture of him. Oh, past... oh no. Oh, well, there's many tattooed cats. Oh, Why? what? They should all be This shot. Oh, that's very kind of... cholo. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's, it's very Russian. <laughs> Santa Maria. It's all shit. Russian people. I, actually, you know what? I would kind of do that. I, I you would do that to your cat? No. No. Man. no. You would never. That's evil. Oh, that looks like a prison shot. I know. Most of these are like Crazy. prison cats, dude. You know they're doing that in prison? Yeah, they're giving prison inmates where you get a cat. cat. They what? get what? Yeah. yeah I'm thinking about prison, going to prison. Where, you, where you get a cat and then um with good behavior and like do you get shit for the cat. Oh. And they find that it's a much better incentive than getting things for yourself. Mm -hmm. And if you get out with good behavior, you get to bring the cat with you get your cat. I love that. I think that's beautiful. Dude, I think that's, that's the way that's it should great. be. Yeah. I want to go to prison. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You get dick all you want. You get cats. <laughs> yeah, it's a You get to work you out. Get more drugs. It's, yeah, it's right. amazing. It's a great place. I say God. next time you're not touring, you should go to prison. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Why not? That'd be the best. <laughs> Only if I could bring my own cat. No, that is not how it works. <laughs> I smuggle my cat in in my own ass. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I bring you a cake with a cat in it. <laughs> yeah. Mr. Fidance, do you have a tail? No. Oh, but that'd be kind of like I was giving birth to him when I pushed him out. Aw. What do you think of that, Jeff? The hard part is going to be getting him visual. in the condom. I hate the visual of it. What'd you say? The hard part is going to be getting him in the condom. Aw, my little guy. Let's not joke about being mean to him. <laughs> He's such no a nice fella. No more cat fella. cruelty. No more cat He's cruelty. He's such a nice fella. <laughs> They're the best. This smoke break is brought to you by YoDelta.com, the official getting high sponsor of the Gas Digital Network. Did you have cats growing up, Jeff? I did have a you cat. You seem like a cat guy. I, I'm not real. I'm allergic to them, if I'm being honest, but I wasn't to the. Our cat got eaten by coyotes when I was a kid. Damn. What? Uh, Jesus, bro. It was like a wild cat. It would kind of roam the neighborhood, and one night the coyotes were howling, and the cat didn't come home. Yeah, it was kind of sad. Oh Honestly, God, yeah. that's a wild we had, west. We had a lot of our our, bird, our pet bird was eaten by a wild cat. Oh, our a, our salamander walked through a fan and just got eviscerated. <laughs> 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 just walk by the like, way, I really did think that the bird was gonna eat your salamander, and this was just a, a tragic cycle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 The cat ate the bird. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we just found a pile of feathers and blood on our driveway. Wait, wait. The bird, we like put him outside in his cage sometimes, <laughs> and then somehow a cat knocked it over, and the door flew open, and it got slaughtered in there. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> really bad. Oh, <laughs> I'm surprised the bird didn't get the fan. Where did yeah, you no, live? We yeah. in just like a suburb in Minnesota. It was, it was Jesus. a wild place. At all. A suburb yeah. with coyotes? There, it's like ki it's on the edge of town. There's like a farm. There's some coyotes there. Living on the yeah. edge of town. Yeah, Sorry, such a badass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I go to the gravel pit sometimes. It's whatever. You ladies hear that? Well, that's coyotes. <laughs> <laughs> I only they ate my, my cat. <laughs> I only put on that voice when I talk about coyotes. That's yeah. it. That's yeah. It. Otherwise, I'm a suburban you need, like, boy. A Why coyote is... skin jacket? Yeah, it's coyote. Why is it coyotes? I don't. Yeah, I think coyote. That's maybe a. Uh, I think I think I'm doing thing. an impression. Yeah, I feel like I'm that's doing like a... an impression of a tough guy. Uh -huh. That's like what they'd say in like Albuquerque or yeah. Santa Fe or Full something. Full of coyotes. Yeah, uh -huh. coyotes. Yeah. Um, it's coyotes. <laughs> <laughs> Just ripping my jugular. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's actually cultural appropriation. Say coyotes. Uh, it's wrong. Dude, the best cultural appropriation I ever got was uh, I was in Seattle at my friend's house. And her roommate was like this classic, like blonde, manic pixie, fucking sure, like party sure. girl, whatever. And they have a beautiful piece of like Native American, like hand woven tapestry framed on the wall, oh. right? And I'm like looking at it, I'm like, wow, in, in my head, I'm like, this is beautiful. And I, I love like Native American sure. jewelry and, and culture and spirituality and everything. So I'm like admiring. I'm like, whoa, look at that. I'm like looking at all the designs. This girl comes up and she goes, 
Isn't that such culture appropriation? We should rip that down. I go, well, I don't know. I think it's more culture appreciation. Yeah, it's yeah. Preserving yeah. something beautiful so other people can see and admire it. And she goes, Yeah, whatever. Do you want to go do a line in the bathroom? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, this is. You don't no, believe we should in this? burn it so no <laughs> white people can look yeah, at yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's so dumb. Yeah. In Canada, I was doing shows there recently. They do a land acknowledgement before every show in Nuh-uh. Montreal. They do like really? a minute long thing. They're like, we are on the Ashawanawana land no. right now. It used to be a place where cultures would come together, and now we're laughing together. <laughs> they would have like an, a minute long speech at the beginning. That's right. And, Wait, be and now we're laughing together, and, like preserving the culture. Yeah, like or now we're this, laughing together, and we're wrong. For no, doing they're it. saying we're good. It's like it's like the old days where cultures came together. Now oh. cultures are coming together to laugh on this sacred land or uh-huh. something. They did it for every show. I mean, really? our great Native American tradition. The bar is located in the back of the. <laughs> <laughs> and we have a two drink minimum. <laughs> Just like the Ashawanawana would have wanted. Yeah. Ashawana would have wanted. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, there we go. <laughs> oh my God. It what was, very was that? odd. Yeah. I don't know. Was why. everyone like, hmm? I think the Canadians were used to it, but the Americans, a couple of Americans kind of laughed. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, just like, it just, it's just pointless. Yeah. Just Is dumb. that their version of like the Pledge of Allegiance or something? I think so. They don't and do that. And then the, do they do O oh, Canada? Yeah. Then we all sang O oh, Canada. Yeah. A great tune, by the way. A great yeah. tune. A better national anthem, we have to say. Well, you heard about what happened with Ben and Jerry's, right? What did they do? It's so delicious. So for 4th of July, they made a tweet that went like massively viral, lost them money, and the tweet was like, it's high time we acknowledge the United States is on stolen indigenous land. Give the land back. And uh, everyone was like, fuck you, Ben and Jerry's. They lost like uh, millions of dollars in stocks like that day. It was such a backfire. And then the tribe that the land that their Vermont offices is on was like, okay, Ben and Jerry's, let's start with you. Give us our land back, <laughs> and then the story went away. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a nice idea, yeah. but it's not yep, gonna happen. Yep, yep. Oh, gonna... it was so wonderful. <laughs> okay, not to be devil's advocate here, <clears throat> but you can have Native Americans have their land and their culture back, mm-hmm. but there's no more Ben and Jerry's. <laughs> is it worth it we need cherry garcia yeah, yeah we like, need it sorry listen the, proud, the, rocky, proud, the rocky road to redemption yeah. Yeah. <laughs> i'm living my americone dream yeah, yeah, yeah. Dream. Uh, trail of tears chocolate chip yeah <laughs> emancipation peanut proclamation <laughs> yeah. i i don't know can you look it up alex did that story go anywhere what if they what if they do give it back? That'd well, be... I I wonder a what they would do with the land, and b if Ben and Jerry's is is fucking all about it. If they'd be like, mm, okay, oh, fine. We or did. if they're like, every day before we uh, make ice cream that's going to kill people, we'll give a land acknowledgement. Or they blame like a 19-year-old intern for sending the tweet out. Oh, Mike, we didn't tell Mike yeah, to send yeah, that yeah. out. He's a junior in college. <laughs> we don't stand behind that. Jeez, you're, you're lucky you're the CEO's cousin. Yeah, yeah, Nothing's yeah. Nothing's happening to Nepo, you. Nepo baby running Ben and Jerry's Twitter. Did you find it? Huh? Yeah, I have a whole article on it. I'm just looking for oh boy. an update. Oh boy, oh, okay. dude, I tried to find an update. They, they, um, the story went nowhere. I'm ben sure and Jerry's they didn't respond. is not like responding. I don't know what is happening. I, I went on their website to see if they even donate money to specific like tribes or funds, and they don't. Oh That's yeah. Right. So it was just an empty <laughs> tweet right. that completely fucking. Because they're backfired. actually usually kind of cool, but that's lame. Well, they're yeah. actually usually donating to stuff. They but are, that's just a and, lame and they empty they gesture. haven't donated in like the in in like the I I couldn't find anything on the site saying that they take funds to give to indigenous right, tribes right. or give anything. Two percent back. That's like back. have you ever been with like a with like a girl and you're like, hey, I, I really think you kind of need therapy, and then the therapist convinced them that you're the problem. Oh <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. You're like, oh shit, I fucked yeah, up. Yeah. Don't go to therapy. Need therapy until you yeah, started dating yeah, Ian. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh-oh. We had a really good talk about you yeah. today. Oh, Just no. being like, oh, oh really? No. Good things, I suppose. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Can we just let losers be losers? 
What? Like we beat the we, we came here and took their shit. I'm sorry. Sometimes people win wars. Sometimes people sometimes people lose wars. Some there's fucking winners and losers and everything. Oh, we don't fucking. I throw a ticker tape parade. I and thought you were talking crying. about therapy. I thought no, we were no. talking about. Therapy. I thought you were talking about me. No, no. <laughs> Getting dumped. I was like, all right, man. Why'd you give the big fucking land acknowledgement about the Burt joke? And yeah. then for me, yeah. you're fucking like, no. But as you far as fucking like, lose, it's just like who fucking? <laughs> so yeah, they lost. I'm sorry. We showed up and we thought of gunpowder. You fucking weirdos. No, I'm sorry. I mean, it. yes, I, I agree to a certain extent, but what we did to those people. Yeah, was... we lied to them so it was <laughs> horrific. All... Yeah, yeah that's the largest you genocide. Consider them the people. <laughs> oh, God, Zach. Oh, no. They are. Oh, I no. look. The Native American chief on my ring says, <laughs> I was about to say. says you're wrong. Yeah, okay. I will fingers. take up for my uh, chimichanga tribe. <laughs> <laughs> I've won a lot of money at their casino. Yes. I got to give them credit. Had yes. Some good times at some Chippewa. Casinos. I love Choctaw. <laughs> yeah, the Choctaw are great people. Dude, Come on. the greatest song of all time is. Tim McGraw, um, Cherokee People. Have you ever heard it? What? He has dude, a song about Cherokee dude, People? Dude, can, oh, wow. can you look up the lyrics and play the song? It is insane how I, I'm all about silly fun and jokes. And, oh, come is on, he that's Cherokee? An no. no. And he's like, he's like, I walk around with my hatchet. <laughs> Go back to my TP. It's like, Tim, oh, no, you don't. It's like him no, you pretending don't. he was a Cherokee yeah, dude, warrior. Yeah. Dude, play it. Can you turn the volume up? Does that work? Or no? Do we have volume on it? Oh, it's called Indian Outlaw. Yes, yes, yeah, yes. Yeah, there we go. That's tight. Oh, I can I can kind of read it. And Indian Outlaw. Have, have Cherokee and Chuck Tall. Got a baby. She's a Chippewa. They would never be dating. Yeah, that's so yeah, far really. away. It makes no sense. What is this, uh, the Montagues? <laughs> She's a one of a kind. By the way, that's how Ben and Jerry solves this. What? Chocolate Chippewa. <laughs> Chocolate Chippewa. And all the pre- oh, benefits go to the Choctaw fucking... and Chippewa. Yeah. yeah. Choctaw Chippewa. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Done. There it is. And not even the best song after the Cherokees. Best Native American song, Cherokee by Europe. Never by heard Europe, it. the band who sings Final Countdown yeah. and Carrier or whatever? Yeah. They really? also Cherokee. Excellent song. Really? 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 Excellent song. Are you a hair metal guy? Uh, big, went, went through my phases. Ah, uh, okay. And that was I, on I, one I of them. I love hair metal. That's yeah. Great. Love a good, got... l- love a good, love, love, love a good Cherokee. Okay. By I'll Europe. look that up. I'll look that Man, up. Man, I've only ever heard Final Countdown. I got to get into this. They got Carrie. They got, that whole fucking album's a banger. They're Damn. a wild guitar. The guitarist was crazy, actually. He was pretty good. He was cl- just copying Eddie Van Halen, but yeah, he was Europe good. Go, dude. Yeah, yeah, they went. Huh. <laughs> huh. Yeah, quit that. listening to ska. And listen <laughs> to some hair metal. Ian. Come on. Well, I poison. have Come heard on. ska does metal. It's a good cover album. Oh, <laughs> Link yeah, 80 really? does uh, um, Harvester of Sorrow. Very good. Oh. Okay. Ska metal. Okay. Yeah, that yeah, yeah. That's crazy. There was a, a ska metal band called Thumper. They were great. Thumper. Yeah. Huh. Mm-hmm. I don't. Okay. I'll, I'll look that up. I, I don't wish think we had the ability like to it. hear. Yeah. Next time. We'll really love. It out. Yeah. We're, we're, learning. we're learning. Well, this dude, the the fucking Cherokee and Chuck Tall. Hearing Tim McGraw just lie about being Native American is so funny to me. Is he the boot up your ass guy, or is no, that Toby Keith? That's, that's Toby, Toby Keith. That's Toby Keith. Toby that's Keith. Toby Keith. Rules, dude. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, who's the guy? Him. Who's the guy that did the new song? Jason like, Aldean. Yeah. So dumb. Oh, I so, love it. It's so. It's such a bad. I musical love it. Song. It's funny. It's, it's funny. funny, dude. It's such a a guy in the country who doesn't go to big cities song mm-hmm. it's like everyone's getting shot and robbed <laughs> not in my small town with no opioid addiction <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah yeah nothing yeah, yeah. wrong here no domestic abuse <laughs> through yeah. the roof yeah. right yeah. no weird <laughs> yeah. sex cult yeah yeah yeah, yeah. no barns, yeah. hey these drag queens better not read to my kids because my daughter has to go to the daughter daddy dance <laughs> yeah, with me yeah. <laughs> <laughs> isn't that way more Long term, deep, psychologically affecting the daddy daughter dance. The daddy daughter dance was fucked up. Right? It fucked it's up. weird. We, we had that. Did we you? That. It's not. Yeah, it was like we would have that at middle school or like elementary school. And what do you have for the for the boys? The the we boy watch have, mommy shower did. time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 
I wouldn't have minded that one. Yeah. Uh, let me sign up for that. Can I get a permission oh. slip for that one? The, oh, the mommy wants that shower. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> mommy, can I watch? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no. Well, am I going to bring oh, this yeah. here? I have, I, have a, I, have a I have a street joke that, that fits this perfectly. There yes. A little kid's, a little boy's watching his mom shower, and mm -hmm. he points at her. At her boobs, and he goes, "Oh, what's that?" And she goes, "Oh, that's where the Native American placed his hands on me, and I grew my drums." And he goes, "Oh, okay." And then he points down at her, 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 her crotch, and he goes, "What's that?" And she goes, "That's where the Indian hit me with his axe." And he goes, "Wow, right in the cunt." <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking great. Dude. That's really good. Like that. That, was, like, there we go. <laughs> that joke made me go ha ha. <laughs> By the way, anybody that's concerned with this, like the Jason Aldean thing, all the shit, they should be more embarrassed that they listen to this fucking modern fucking hip hop fucking dog shit pop country. Oh, it's terrible music. It's terrible. Like, music. if you listen to country music and it's anything contemporary, Yuck. Dude, yeah. people, much, people much. have tried to get me into country by going, no, this isn't old country. This is new country. Oh. And it, it truly sounds like those mega churches that have a band that yeah. try to be cool. Yeah, yeah like, I've heard it described as hip hop. Oh. oh yeah, they, yeah. It's, they have yeah they have, it like no, has like a Ryan, rap verse. No, yeah that's like a, a rap verse now. Yep, yep. Kane know. Brown. Oh, it's so bad. Morgan I, Wallen. Oh, it's so uh, bad. You know all. I know all. <laughs> of them, unfortunately, <laughs> you gotta you gotta research. You, you gotta just research. Got nine T-shirts. Yeah. I only home. I just go to their concerts all year because I hate them. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Huge Morgan. Yeah, Wallen I don't know. Man. I I I think the song is so fun. Like. Like that Kid Rock song that came out that was like uh We the People. Or, oh wait, my which God. one? Because we listened to both yes. in the car that yes, day. Yes, we did. And we undid the windows and drove Ian around singing yeah. Kid Rock. Yeah. Nice. Well, so oh, there's yeah. the first one, which is uh Ain't nobody gonna, gonna tell me how to live. <laughs> and then the second is the Let's Go Brandon one. Yes. He we says the Let's people. Go Brandon. Oh, it's dude. The chorus. Dude, in no. in one of the songs he goes, Oh well, y'all know Fauci is a liar. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. One of the first, yeah, when, in, so when he's like getting warmed up at the beginning, like he's doing his like speaking part, he goes, yeah, fuck Fauci. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Can you imagine going back in time, be like, I could do this rapper, what's, what's, what's his beef? Oh, with the guy who runs the center of disease control. <laughs> <laughs> they have political differences. He's also going to be singing that song in 20 years. People are like, who the fuck is Fauci? Yeah. No yeah. one's going to remember that yeah. name. Oh my God, that's embarrassing. Yeah. Yeah. Another lyric in that same song is, Black Lives Matter. No shit, motherfucker. <laughs> it's fucking tight, dude. <laughs> he's such a fool. I think he's a visionary, oh, honestly. <laughs> Here's, I like that. I like how silly it is. I like being like, yeah. If it but was I don't, meant to be silly, I would that's like it. That's the thing. If that's I, the thing. Like it's it like, then. it's like, I, like that Jason Aldean song. It's funny to me to sing it. Right. But then it's like, I, I'm afraid of listening too long and then being like, I'm gonna is listen to this. Not that yeah, it actually, it's actually you know good, what? You should safer. try it in a small town. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I think I'm going to a small town. I know, like, have you ever done something ironically and then the irony's over and you're now mm, into that thing? I'm trying to think like that. Yes, I'm watching gay sex. I'm, what? Watching, <laughs> <laughs> I'm watching the Fast and the Furious franchise right now. Completely started ironically. I'm on six. Dead in. Whoa. Love it. Looking forward to more. Yeah. And I'm invested in the storyline. Yeah. Fuck yeah. I would dude. say my love for hair metal was ironic, and now it's not. There it is. I would say that's yeah. one thing. Yeah. I used to be like, Def Leppard's kind of corny, and I'm like, I love Def Leppard. Oh, yeah. They're great. Dude, They're they great have an band. album. What is it? Trucking All Through the Night or whatever? Not it's... Def Leppard, no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah. Def Here, Leppard has a song, Trucking No, no. no. Album, a, uh, trucking an an album. Night. It must be newer then. I don't, I don't know that one. Uh, Mrs. Amico actually said to me the other day, she goes, I thought you used to talk about Insane Clown Posse all the time, ironically, but now I keep seeing you listening to them <laughs> when no one else is there. <laughs> and I realize you just really wow. like it. On Through the Night is on the album, the and night. it's got a big truck on the cover. Yes, oh, yeah? yes, Dude, yes. that, 
before they turned into arena hair metal. Yeah, they were kind of like a little grungy. Dude, little they had funky, like yeah. killer rips yeah, and yeah. fucking like real rock. They definitely and roll. got really sugary pop, but oh, I yeah. like that too. Yeah. But they used to be a little underground. Yeah, yeah there it is. Are you saying on somebody poured some sugar night. on them? <laughs> oh <laughs> no! That's was that good. Def Leppard? That was Def Leppard. Wow, what terrible a, song. What about Bloodhound Gang? The drummer from Def Leppard only has one arm. The drummer from <laughs> Def Leppard only has one arm. <laughs> you know that song. <laughs> Do you know what I've been getting? Bloodhound Gang fucking they rips, by bangers. the way. They they at least three Lane. great albums. Dude, yeah. One Fierce Beer Coaster? Are you kidding me? Holy <laughs> fuck. I don't Dude. remember that. Is that the album title? The that's song? the one album that has title. that that's the one that has um Firewater Burn. Firewater Burn on oh, it. Yeah. Okay. We don't need no water. Let the motherfucker burn. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Burn, yeah. motherfucker. That whole record's burn, really good though. Gun, gun, gun. Hello, my name is Jimmy Poppin. I'm a dumb white guy. I'm not old but new, but middle school like Dim Ben Ging Ging guy. I don't remember the rest <laughs> of the lyrics, but I will sing it. Not but gonna go, go, Zach, your time to wing it. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. You pulled got it through. at the end. You got pulled it through. at the end. I was like, what's he gonna do here? That was yeah, good. I'm hung that like planet good. Pluto. Yeah, 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 can't, can't see, see with, with the naked, naked eye. But again, I'm kind of like hum- Solo, always <laughs> playing my own Wookiee. I'm the root of all that's evil. Evil, yeah, yeah, but you, you can, can call me cookie. cookie. <laughs> yes, yes. That's tight. That and yeah. the one after that is Hooray for Boobies, which is like oh, seven yeah. bangers on it. Oh, dude, they have a song called Pennsylvania, and the the uh, the final chorus is, do you even know what a Wawa is, <laughs> yeah. girl? Oh, damn. Do you? Oh, God. Damn. They they legit have some good pop they bangers, from Philly? dude. They're from Philly, oh, yeah. Really? Have you ever seen okay. the video of them playing at that college uh, when they were in a bunch of trouble and the whole crowd chants, fuck you, Bloodhound Gang? No. And they do it with them. What are they oh. in trouble for? They had a song called Yellow Fever. Mm. Oh yeah, that was sure, all about sure. like Asian chicks. Okay, and some like Asian American defamation league picked it up and like it got they got it taken off the album, like it was a big thing. And they play and they did a protest at one of their concerts, and it's all these college girls screaming "fuck you, Bloodhound Gang," and them on stage dancing to the chant, singing <laughs> "fuck you, Bloodhound Gang." Wow, <laughs> that's great. That's fucking cool, dude. Still getting paid. I love it. Damn, fuck. What was a I I have them on so many playlists of mine. Really? Dude, v- the vagina three point one four holds oh. up to this and great karaoke song. Wow, dude, Mary Jane. Yeah, that's a great song. It's uh, Along Comes Mary. Along Comes Mary. Yeah, yeah, yeah which yeah, is yeah. on the I believe the half baked the half baked soundtrack. Yes, oh. and the girl's name was Mary Jane. Yes, 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 Aren't they yes, 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 yes. Too now. Oh, dude. Yeah, yeah right. but like, well, not with. I think Harlan Williams I think cameos it's all in new it. People, it's all new people, and yeah. Mary Jane's in it. But I think Harlan Williams is like the only like yeah, cameo. Yeah, and Brewer's not in it because they made him get vaxxed to be in it. Yeah, hilarious. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. I love that guy. Yeah, Brewer would have to he's admit great. dinosaurs are real yeah. Yeah. in order for him to be in a movie. So uh, yeah. he's just going to stay home have and fucking- Have you seen the video of him uh, Let me tell you. Yeah. Uh, Jim Brewer being an anti-vaxxer didn't see that on my bingo card. Yeah. <laughs> Wasn't on my 2022. Yeah, so- that he's he's, he's just going to be calling Chris Kattan gay for another 20 years. Is that um, what he does? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Dude, some of his, dude, he was on some show the other day, and he was so unfunny. Really? He was just, like, spouting vaccination facts. And I'm no. Like, dude, you're, this is not, you're the guy who has the story about how all the liquors have a party in your tummy. Yeah. Do not yeah, you're fucking lecture drunk, me. You're goat drunk boy. Party guy. You're yeah. goat boy. Be yeah. goat boy. Yeah, yeah. Boy. <laughs> oh yeah, dude. Some of his shit is fucking. Where he I mean, just like goes like this and pretends like he's like. Uh, have you seen that video of yeah, him doing yeah. stand up where he's just like squawking on stage? I have it's no idea. It, it's such. It's so funny. Utter right, poor I have shit. A bit where I squawk. Yeah, no, no, not, it's, 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 it's not as good. It's not no, as no. Good. Every it's it's and he's such a funny dude. And the fact that he would just get so like, dude, it broke our brains. It, he would it let it break his brains. funny. It's just like a quick cash grab, but then it leads nowhere. It's such. Well, a dude, bad I was idea. thinking about this. Like when when you make that turn, where like you're doing that for your fan base and everything. Imagine the hell you're in when you then have an opinion that doesn't fall in line with what your fan base is expecting. And then you're like, well, I guess now I just have to keep this inside. And then you have to be that guy. Because if you're like, well, I 
actually, I don't and if you're on stage, like, actually, you. the Civil War was about slavery, and they're like, this is not what <laughs> yeah, we yeah, want yeah, to yeah. hear, man. Burr, this is not yeah. why we're here. Yeah. <laughs> yep, yep. Dude, I, oh my God. I remember when, when I was teaching test prep in public schools, one of the questions was like, what was the Civil War about? Oh, <laughs> and no. was, the answer was like, states' rights. Really? Like, oh, yeah, yeah. oh my yeah. God. And kids are like, slavery. And I'd have to be like, I, look, I'm gonna be honest I didn't you. write the question. Uh, yeah. You're right. But if you want to pass the test, you got to put this. <laughs> but, you know, just make sure you get some other answers correct and then get that you one wanna wrong. You want to go to Liberty <laughs> University. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, no. Stay just me, whitey, a bit yeah. with all black underprivileged. It's actually about speech. tariffs. Yeah, it's yeah, about yeah, tariffs. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. States rights. These two guys uh -huh. didn't get along. That's yeah. truly it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You mean Mr. Finance, uh, you would be a room full of black people and they had to do whatever the white man in the front said? <laughs> yes. <laughs> like right here? <laughs> <laughs> they didn't get paid to show up to the same place every day? Dude, one of the fucking teachers told me one time, she was like, I, 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 I was like, I I'm having such a hard time, like, how do I get through to these kids? Uh, yeah. and, and she was like, you know what I tell them? I tell them, what? You want to live off the white man for the rest of your life? You want the white man to be the one to control everything? Blah, blah, blah. And she's like, that's what you got to tell them. And I was like, all right, yeah. And then the next day, I was like, if you don't want to pay attention, then you're going to be living off the white man for the rest of your life. And then halfway through, I was like, I'm the... I know I'm the white man, but I'm I'm a not the one white, white a different guy. white man. <laughs> it yeah. was just the other a white man bad. who makes better decisions than me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 Oh god, I fucking really screwed the pooch oh, on that no. one. A white man who took advantage of his privilege. <laughs> oh dude, yeah, dude. I, I you're fucking... trying to cover up your white skin. You're <laughs> yeah, doing really. Your best. Fucking... <laughs> Dude, I took out Talib Kweli lyrics, and I was like, let's read oh these. Oh, my God. <laughs> turn your chair <laughs> like, around. They, I just thought I had to turn your chair around and wear a leather jacket. Right. And, be like, this is, and they were like, that's gay. And I'm yeah. like, well, you know, that's okay, They too. probably don't like Talib Kweli. Like, they, they, they don't want that. They don't want that. They hated that. it. They're like, you know Young Thug? Yeah, play like, Chingy or whatever. I don't know what year yeah. this was. Brother, in. sister, yeah. cousin. Oh, it was around the time, uh, oh, this was my big <laughs> laugh. We've been spending most of our life. How come Mr. Fidance doesn't have a wife? <laughs> <laughs> oh dude this was uh what was that guy's fetty wop fetty oh, yeah. i would walk in the Trap room queen. i would yeah. walk in the room and go hey what's up hello and they'd be like oh you crazy <laughs> oh, <laughs> dude, my god. oh my god Woo! that's a legend move though that's what they wanted you learn the nay nay you oh dude great. oh dude You're a king. i fucking would flame the shit when i taught high schoolers it was the best we could like they got jokes, they understood shit, but when I taught grade school, it was a fucking nightmare. Oh, like yeah. they could not They're not smart. Everything enough to get it. everything was like, I'm getting bullied, he's doing that, this is me, blah and and, and it like I, I could not even make a joke that they would like I, I one of them lied and said I told uh, her that she needed to be on pills because she was like, uh, so and so is taking crazy pills and I go Look, we're all going to have to take crazy pills if you guys don't start behaving, okay? Uh, and then and she, she, she told her dad oh that I was God. like, you need to be on crazy pills. And I'm like, what? Was like, dude, they're pissed? all little. F yes, they're all little fucking liar manipulators. Sure. That's why you can't believe kids when they say they're trans. <laughs> anyway, do you guys want to do plugs? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> That's why all yeah. those altar boys are lying. <laughs> yeah. Doing it for attention. That's we why you it. should not believe anything you read about me on the internet. <laughs> Everyone is a liar. All oh. right. No, but dude, high school was the fucking shit, man. They like, we really? would roast each other. It was the fucking best. Damn, that's fun. Yeah. They'd be like, uh, how come, how come no black kids are in the room yet? And I was like, well, cause I don't like them. And they were like, <laughs> yeah. oh, you crazy. Okay. Come on in. Yeah. And then they'd all pile class in. only started eight minutes ago. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Mr. Yeah, Fidance, like can you teach me how to doggy, please? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they were like, "I don't speak old man." I was like, "Why well, don't speak dumb idiot?" So we can't understand each other. I'm like, yeah. "Oh, you right?" And then they do the work. Also, you're like 25, and they're calling you an old man. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. An ancient yeah. human being. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was crazy. Yeah, I never. I thought I'd never make it to. I thought like, I'll never be 25. Oh yeah. How could I ever be 25? Doesn't it seem it's like I, when when we were? I I know for me when I was like in high school and I would like see the see they seem so old. Like, oh, everybody yeah. seems so old, and then now I, like, like if you walk around the East Village at night, it's like a children's playground with, like, oh, kids in their there. 20s, and they look like fucking babies, dude. It's gross. I'm like, They're all, I like, to be young little kids. Like, yeah. yeah. I'm like, the... I'm still attracted to them? <laughs> what? 
<laughs> Why is my dick working and my morals aren't? Yeah, God what is it. happening? <laughs> no, but it's, I, I don't know, it's, it's weird. They're, yeah. uh, they all look like, like kids in college look like fucking kids. And ba- way back when, kids in college looked like they'd been paying a mortgage for like two decades. Right, I know. Yeah, yeah. It's like weird. I went back to the bar I used to go to in college like a year ago and oh. I did not fit in. It was like, I, everyone was looking at me like, what the fuck is grandpa doing here trying to play pool again? You're like they trying would, to high five. I'm trying to play yeah. like like They're calling the party police. in the USA on the touch tunes. Like, <laughs> yeah. this is what we play when I was in college. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> They're like, hey, hey, put on right there. Put on that kid right there. Yeah, yeah. Pursuit <laughs> yeah. of happiness. Yeah. yeah. Great album. Great, Amazing. Great. Holy fuck. Kid Cudi was Jesus awesome. Jesus Christ. Uh, first Hold two on, albums. Can I, can I remember? I'm in the pursuit of happiness. It's so easy. It's the f- shut up, Tristan. Wait, shut what's up. the pursuit of happiness? Every- yeah, pursuit of happiness. Yeah. 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 yeah, it's a great song. Gold. Kid Cudi yeah. rocked. Those first like, so two good. or three albums are like perfect. Dude, Mr. Solo Dolo, that oh, yeah. fucking incredible. I remember getting out of rehab and then it just like came out. Oh wow, and that's I would perfect. just like listen to that alone. And then when I started gonna be like I think we're gonna drink I'd be like this would be a good song to listen to while I'm drunk driving <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Kid you Cudi didn't realize he makes the perfect drunk yeah. driving music he makes the perfect music to relapse to <laughs> just like smoking a blunt mushrooms drunk driving like yeah I'm in the pursuit of happy yeah yeah that would be <laughs> a good one to go to little bit yeah, right yeah, up yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, I would I watched Project X when I was in like 7th grade and that was like the main like party theme song where it's like oh yeah and i was just like this is gonna be my fucking life and then i didn't graduate high school and, I'm like, <laughs> and i'm just like god damn it this sucks my life a movie and it's <laughs> yeah. a movie they show to kids what yeah. not to do yeah. it's a ged <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. instructional that's what it is uh, <laughs> it sucks so bad you didn't graduate high school no nah, i got my ged why didn't you graduate high school? Uh, I was I was failing really bad, and I was doing stand up at the time, and I'm like, I want to do stand up. No so, way! Wow. Yeah. Damn. So. And how how what year were you in? Uh, I started doing stand up when I was a sophomore, but I was a, I I got to like last semester senior year, and I'm like, oh, so you were so close. I was so close. Dang. I stopped at the finish line of the marathon. Like, it also doesn't matter. I know. It literally means nothing. Dude, I had to deliver pizzas to my buddies' like parties that night, and I was just like, I'm. I want to fucking kill myself oh, right now. Oh, God, where they're graduating? And oh, you're gradu- like, here's four Domino's oh, pizzas. Yeah. All of my friends being like, yo, you want a beer? And I'm like, I'm working until three. Like, oh, the, God. dude, it sucks. Should so put bad. some Kid Cudi on and drank it. <laughs> yeah. Dude, it, it just. Dude, like, that. It I, I had to. So when I lived in a halfway house, I would go door to door doing um, construction estimates in the town. I grew up in. Uh-huh. Oh, nice. So I was going to people's houses, like f- kids that I went to school with, I was going to their parents' houses and having to hear how successful their kids were while I was like having to stop work early enough to be at my halfway house on time for check-in. Oh, God. <laughs> you're, yeah. And yeah. you're telling them like you're gonna they're going to spend a quarter million on a new kitchen or whatever. <laughs> yeah, and yeah, you're yeah. doing, oh, my they're God. like, oh, Tony's married. We're ex- he's expecting a third kid. Well, he's, you know, uh, getting his doctorate. And I'm like, your roof looks like it's leaking soon. Would you like <laughs> yeah. a free? Just I'm a professional liar. Like, we're going to we're gonna be doing construction down the road. They can stop by, blah, blah. And meanwhile, the seller guy is a crack addict who fucking every time he'd make a big sale, he'd disappear. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah, ooh, 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 God. Dude, if you look up that construction business's um, ratings online, the one that I did the estimates for, it's all like, they're liars. They're <laughs> they never did the work. They, yeah, yeah. yeah. Ian, they I stole my, my money. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, dude. We used to get the police called on us all the time for, for door-to-door what? soliciting. Oh, yeah. Oh, you had to go so door-to-door funny. and ask. I was people, a door-to-door what do you solicitor. Want to fix in your house. Well, we would we would go like, um, you know, hey, I, when, when was the last time you had your roof work? Oh, you know? it looked like you might have a leak well, over yeah, there. Yeah. Oh, you, you know, shit. we're doing a program now. Oh man, you can't. You'd get shot doing that now. You do that I now. Like oh you, yeah, that, that door-to-door. Well, is dude, done. I worked my way up to be like a manager and I had a crew and I would hire like high school kids 
And uh, I hired a bunch of black kids, and we would go around together, and we had a game where we would time how fast the police would come. They would come? Yeah, oh, yeah. People would call time. the cops on them immediately. Oh, my yeah. God. Yeah, it's yeah. crazy. And we would all, like, get in the car and, like, laugh and high-five. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> a minute 35. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We Holy got our PR. Shit. Yeah, you know? we got the N-word in 20 yeah. seconds. <laughs> oh, dude, the cops would get called on me, and then, like... My my crew would be around. And I'd try to sell the cop a roof. <laughs> like it was just like <laughs> yeah. Man, the cops literally would just come and be like, "All right, come on now." Like they didn't. There was no. It's not like, illegal. A re- it's it's or it is, but not some really. neighborhoods would have like no solicitors oh, like or whatever. Or, but yeah. people would call the police, and the cops would just like shoo us shoo us away to the next neighborhood. And, and yeah. they'd literally be like, "Look, you can't be here, but there's no sign on the neighborhood over there." We're like, "Okay, uh, cool, okay. thank you." That's Damn. fucking tight. Dude, one, oh, Jesus Christ. One guy, so Obama did a program where um, you would get tax write-offs it, to incentivize construction work and environmental work. Oh, so sure. if you got a certain type of window, shingle, siding, whatever, you would get tax write-offs because it was good for the environment. It got people worried. This is after 2008. Yeah. And uh, that was one of like the selling points. You know, the, the president's enacted this blah, 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 blah. And so, dude, I swear to God. <laughs> white guy, old white guy, shirt off, oh, answered the door no. drunk. And I was like, hey, sir, have you shingled? He's like, what? What do you want? And I go, well, uh, President Obama. And he goes, things ain't been right since that moon has been in office. Oh, my and yeah. I was like, okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, he, uh, well, he wants to uh, fix your room. Yeah. 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 I was like, well, I know you hate him, but he's here for you. Come on, fella. Yeah. Oh, yes, I was like, I don't think he's the reason why you don't have teeth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shirtless. He's not the reason why you're drunk at Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah sorry. It's literally 1.30 in the afternoon. <laughs> you leak like, a booze and you stink. It's, it's 20% Comrade of the Obama. reason. Yeah. Is he the reason why your lawn has a car on it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have a garage door. Yeah. Of, yeah. Yeah. Mama. In a roundabout uh, way, yes. Dude, one time a guy pulled a gun on me. And uh, he had one of those things that was like, trespassers will be shot, blah, blah, I'll be shot again, or what, you know, yeah, those stickers. Right, yeah. So he opened the door and he goes, get off my lawn. I was like, well, before I get off, why don't you <laughs> consider getting a 30 year architecture? You needed the money real uh, bad. Oh, dude, dude. Yeah. I, it was like a game because it was, it was almost like a game to see how much you could piss people off. Right, because yeah, right. They would start at such a high, irrational, an ir- irrational level of like anger opening the door. Right. That yeah. it was like fun. To you just... feel bad for the Jehovah's Witnesses. They're doing mm-hmm. this for out for no money. Mm-hmm. They're doing it for the fun of the game. Yeah, they're doing it for salvation. I'm doing it so I can get a money order to pay my rent in the halfway house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You have to be home before the street lights go on or else you're fucking homeless, dude. <laughs> you're just like getting a deal and you're just like checking outside be like fuck 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 fuck. Oh. Just have a gun pointed at you like, but have you thought about getting new shingles? <laughs> dude, yeah. but the guy pulled a gun. He's like, get off my property. Property, and I was like, "Sir, why don't you put the gun away and think about what we can do for you in your house?" And he was like, "I'm not fucking joking." I was like, "Okay, okay, okay." <laughs> and I'm like backing up and still like pick because I'm like, "There's no way this guy gonna yeah, shoot me." Yeah, yeah, yeah. On. And then I'm like at the tip of his driveway. I'm like, "Now that I'm not on your property, we are offering." He's like, "Got the fuck out!" And I'm like, "Ha ha!" And I think I did want to die. So. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you, you had a death warrant. <laughs> Yeah, no, yeah I would not do that today. I have to go meet my seven other roommates who are doing just as bad as me. So yeah, if you I have to really... go kick a friend out who uh, is now doing pills. <laughs> yeah, if you could God. expedite yeah. this whole thing, that'd mm. be great. Yeah. Well, what can you do? Let's what? get plugs out of the way, Bubba. Oh, yeah, let's you're just, right. Let's, let's do plugs. that. Yeah. Uh, I'm on, uh, I have my own podcast, The Final Stop, if you want to listen to that. And uh, Tristan is a comedian on Instagram. If you want to follow me, see what I'm doing, I uh, just did an episode of Kill Tony recently, so I'll be posting about that. Hey, nice. Hell yeah, Hell yeah, yeah nice. 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 Is, me, is it my yeah. turn? Okay, yeah. I got a new YouTube special out last week called The Only Funny White Man. Please watch it. I'm still $12,000 in the hole. Please watch it. (laughs) Also, look at my tour dates on (laughs) whitecomedian.com. I bought the URL years ago, and it's the greatest thing I've ever done in my life. Please buy some tickets. Hey, hey, check Jeff out. He's hilarious. Uh, Zachy. Uh, On the 26th, I'll be at Portland, Maine, in the Portland Comedy Festival. I'm at the uh, Helium on the 30th. That's a fucking banging show. It is myself, Dad Meat, Deer Tag, and the Do-Rag. And Crack Amico. Whoa. All at Helium. 
in uh, Philly. In Philly. Oh, dude. That'll doing be uh, double sets. Each of us are going to pair up. So oh, I think great. it's going to be me and Rainy doing a set together. Oh, dude, that's, that's so fun. fun. Then right after that, I am at the Creek and the Cave in Austin, Texas on the 1st and 2nd. I believe the day after that, we're at the brand new Sunset Strip Comedy Club doing a live Real Ass podcast. Then I'm home for a couple days. Then I'm at Side Splitters in Tampa on the 8th and the 10th. Look at oh, you, yeah. Zachy. Fuck, Fuck yeah. yeah. Go out, see Zach. He's fucking hilarious. I, I animal 6 9 on Twitter, Twitch, and Instagram. Uh, August 4th, 5th, and 6th, I'm at the Addison Improv in Dallas, Texas. And then I'll be at Comedy Bar Toronto, Carlson, uh, Comedy on Carlson, Rochester, Brea Improv, and uh, American Comedy Company, ianfinance.com for tickets. Uh, and Zach, what can people do if they like the show? Well, they can go to gasdigital.com, use that promo code GUYS30 for a 30-day free trial to not just this show, but all the great shows available on Gas Digital Network. They can also go to merchengine.com, where I have hats, hoodies, long sleeves, and t-shirts. And thank you for wearing merch at the shows. It truly means a lot. Yes. Amazing. Before we go, let's get into a story. What do you say? Yeah, absolutely. Zach, buddy. what are you thinking? Do you see any of these? You pick, because my paper's on the floor, and I don't want to bend over. Okay. <laughs> we talked about Jason Aldean. Now, on the other side of it, Tyler Childers' new video, In Your Love, okay. is apparently showing gay love in rural America. Oh, yeah. there we go. Can we see this video? Isn't he good? I feel like he's a good country musician. I feel like I've heard him before. Uh, Isn't that like it. Take Me to Church, too? They did gay sex in rural areas. Oh, the Hosier yeah, song? Yeah, the Hosier song. They? What oh, song okay. is that? Take me, me to church. Yeah. 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 My that... love has got yeah. humor. Yeah. yeah. That's a pretty good. That's a good Whoa. song. Whoa. Yeah. That's a good song. He that was like good Michael voice. McDonald. Yeah, <laughs> that <was laughs> that great. did. Sorry, he sounded for... like a Doobie Brother. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Four yeah, years right, of choir that... in high school. <laughs> okay. Well, three and a half. Shut the fuck up. He's like, I just want to do choir. I don't want to learn math. That was part of my GED test. Really? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Are these guys having... Is this coal miners about to fuck? Oh my god, that is so hot. Oh, dude. Let's go. Oh, look oh. at him horsing around. Just yes. Oh, god. Oh, my god. Do you think gay coal miners keep a canary in their asshole? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that way, when it dies, you know not to fuck them? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> is it, or you know his T cell count yeah. drops? Yeah. Were these two guys just reading the Bible? Oh, together? they're on an American flag. They're having sex. Hell yeah. Oh yeah, this would probably make some of my uncles mad. Oh yeah, <laughs> they did not like this. Why are they gay or coal miners? <laughs> <laughs> Is he jerking off? Possibly on? both. Oh my god. Oh, that's a beautiful. Oh, some guys seeing them have sex. <gasps> oh no. This is a. Great oh, he's story. angry. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Beat up. Oh. You're kissing other people, you son of a bitch. Or is, if, it, is it a cheating thing? Yeah, or is it their cheating? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. This is fun watching without the sound because we play a guessing game. What? Oh, my God. Oh, now this is, in my fantasy, they all gang up on him and have sex with him to teach him a lesson. We don't know where it's going. So nah, it kidding. Bad. Is this fantasy? Yeah, it's kind of a weird... Ian is also known when having gay sex for digging for coal. <laughs> <laughs> you oh, gotta no, fuck him. got the miner's lung. <laughs> Black no lung. way. Is he going to die from black lung? Coughing up cum. <laughs> cum <laughs> lung, dude. Cum lung. If you fuck a coal miner hard enough, he turns into a diamond. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Are they gay together on a date at someone's house? What year is this where gay love is accepting and coal mining is a, <laughs> a big profession that people are involved in? 19. Yeah, right. Yeah. The food, <laughs> food stamps live tonight. That's what? the name of the band. <laughs> <laughs> this is hell yeah oh that yeah it's Tyler Chilling oh, Tex yeah. Hooper gay country I country got, I, gay I wish I knew what the lyrics were yeah. I know yeah we'll you have can to, see a little down there we'll have to watch this later what if they were just so ham fisted what if it's just like I'm gay you're <laughs> gay we're all gay <laughs> yeah. being gay's okay yeah <laughs> gay in the workplace gay on the street <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> gay every night. It's Nate, Nate, Nate. <laughs> it's like the number one country. Don't, song. Get, don't get it twisted. Still not a lot of black guys around here. <laughs> yeah, 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 right. Yeah, that right. is very funny. There's no black people. Oh, he is dying of black yeah. lung. That's exactly uh, what's happening. His lungs are black. So yeah. there's a, there there's it a little is. Yeah. So they're going to get lynched. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. His lungs will be. There's right. nothing wrong with a man loving another man as long as both those men are of the white race. Oh, oh. he died of black lung. He died in the field. Oh. Get him up. Take him. I will stand my ground. Cry. All right, let's get one more in before you go. <laughs> he just happens to... <laughs> Just happens to have an oxygen. Can mask you at still house. get hard? <laughs> oh, kiss him one last time. Dang. Oh, I can, uh, not a not a bad video. Right? A bad video. Tells a story, makes you hard, makes you cry. Nothing says America like holding your husband. Because we like to act arms. like everyone's gay now. They've always been gay. Yeah, everyone's always been gay. They just weren't. They just weren't. They talking just weren't about telling it. people yeah. about it out loud till they were thirty-two. Yeah, yeah. Or <laughs> talked till they were dead. Yeah, yeah. Is, wow. Okay. Colton Haynes. Haynes is that his name? That was. Did the it act. say Colton Haynes? If they replace, it's H A Y N E S. So is not Haynes. Haynes. Is that an actor? Uh, oh, but if they that, replace that G with an H. Colton Haynes. Oh. Yeah, Colton Haynes. I think yeah, wouldn't that be actor. funny if they all had gay sex names? <laughs> Colton <laughs> Haynes. Yeah. <laughs> Mark. Billy bricked up. Yeah, we got there. <laughs> yeah, we got there. Yeah. Jimmy the load. <laughs> Jimmy the load. <laughs> Andy 12 inch Mahulahan. <laughs> Mahulahan. There we go. Chris facing the pillow, Mechowitz. <laughs> All right, let's he was look. the Pollock in the crew. <laughs> John no, Queer. That's my name. John Just Queer. John Queer. John Queer. <laughs> John Queer Public. That's people don't know that's what the Q and John Q Public stands for. Say he's a big queer in public. Mark Lockjaw. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's wrap it up. Let's wrap it up. This is great. Thank, Thank you, you guys for tuning in. Yes. Thank you to our wonderful guests. Uh, Jeff, please plug your special one more time. My special, The Only Funny White Man on YouTube. Please, for the love of God, watch it. I put everything I have into it. I'm almost dead. Please watch it. Please watch it. And thank you to our guests. Thank you to the crew. Thank you for setting us up in the Boiling the Hot Studio. The new studio. studio. <laughs> yes. I, I am going to pass out. Thank you yep. guys so much for being here. And we will catch you next week here on... Bye, Bye guys. guys. <laughs> uh.